Two weeks from today, your taxes are due. Yet with the April 18th deadline fast approaching, millions of taxpayers still have not filed their taxes. So this morning, CPA Lisa Green Lewis joining us to share tips on filing those taxes quickly and easily, which I think is the key word. Good morning, Lisa. Good morning. So for those who've been putting it off, my husband is certainly one of them. Where should they just start? First of all, don't panic. You still have some time. Um, second, gather all your documents in one place. So, you know, documents that report your income, like your W-2s and 1099s. You want to have those so you don't leave anything out. And then forms and receipts that show expenses that can be deductible. You want to have those all together. And then third, go online and e-file with direct deposit. That's the fastest way to get your tax refund. So we've been hearing some reports of records of people owing money this year. Is this tied to former President Trump's tax reform bill, allowing for fewer deductions? Um, what we're seeing is under the American Rescue Plan, um, there were some provisions that were only good for tax year 2021. And those have either reverted or gone away. So, for instance, the child tax credit in 2021, that was up to $3,600. That's gone back to $2,000. And the child and dependent care credit, that's another example. That was up to $8,000 for two kids. That's gone back to $2,100. So if you were able to claim those in tax year 2021 and you're claiming them again, you may see a difference in your um, tax refund. All right, Lisa Green-Lewis, thank you so much for that information and important reminder. Thank you. All right, we will be right back after this break.